After barely edging the Yukon Huskies New Year's Day in their Big East home opener, Marquette basketball found themselves embroiled in another close matchup, this time with the Georgetown Hoyas. After a late miss three by the Hoyas and two free throws from Devontae Gardner, Marquette was able to pull out the win, 49-48. to Yeah, I mean, I, I think I'm finally coming around. Everybody's really helped me out as far as in the program and my teammates and coaches, and uh, things are kind of starting to fit in. In the game where there was very little offense, Marquette started to see some production out of senior transfer Trent Lockett. Though he did give Georgetown an opportunity to tie the game and send it into overtime, Lockett was eventually the one who sealed the deal with 9 points and 10 rebounds. Uh, I, I, if I only have one answer, I would say it was on the glass. Um, I thought we had a really strong presence on both ends of the floor, offensive rebounds and defensive rebounds. I think Trent Lockett was outstanding. Um. The Golden Eagles out-rebounded Georgetown 34-26. Despite the Hoyas starting lineup consisting of four men over six foot eight, Marquette's athleticism and hustle seemed to help them beat out the Hoyas on the boards and in the game as a whole. Uh, it just shows that, you know, we didn't let up from that UConn game. Uh, we came in with the right focus. We know uh, Georgetown's a tough scout. You know, they got a great, that Princeton offense is hard to study and uh, hard to execute. And uh, the guys showed a, a great sign of maturity by, you know, having like three days to prepare for them and coming out and uh, getting the victory, even though it was a low scoring game. The Golden Eagles will now find themselves on the road facing the Pittsburgh Panthers January 12th. Reporting from the BMO Harris Bradley Center, Sean Owens, MUTV Sports.